Hi guys, George here from Zero Peer Productions, and today on Skyrim Saturday, I'm taking a look at Heartmere Isle, a quest mod by Tension69. Heartmere Isle is a new world space with fully voice acted characters, plenty of locations to explore, a main quest line in which you become the Thane, and several side quests as well. The mod is currently a work in progress, and many interior locations, such as homes, dungeons, and other structures, are not yet available. That being said, even without these areas to explore, there's hours worth of content already in the mod. The main quest line seems to be finished for the most part, and the mod has been updated again since I last recorded. I will be coming back to the mod at a later date, once it has been fully completed, so that I can finish the main quest, side quests, and explore the rest of the aisle. But for now, let's get started. So to get started, head over to the Solitude Lighthouse, where there should be a boat waiting for you. Just got here, so let's kind of see. Kind of foggy out. Oh, I think I see the boat right now. Alright. Oh, and there's the captain. Uh, sir, you seem to have parked right across these rocks. Oh no, just very close to. Very risky move, let me Hello. tell you. Hello! Greetings, madame. Is this your boat? Yes, it is. I ferry folk between here and Hartmere Isle. How'd you do that without your lips moving? Ah, uh, farewell and safe journeys, madame. Then let's go. All right, but if you're sick, it'll be you scrubbing the deck. All right, whatever you say. Let's see if Arissa follows me. Actually, I don't even know if I had Arissa with me. Heart, mirror, doc, discovered. Oh, look, there's the guards. Oh, and who are they? Oh, no, that's just another guard, isn't it? If you can hold down more than two bottles of mead at the Dragon Bridge Inn, you're a better man than I. Do you guys have a separate Dragon Bridge here? You should visit the Jarl if you're new here. Alright, lip sync is not working, clearly. Let me guess. You're tired, lost, and hungry. Hey, no. It's hungry, tired, thirsty, and that's only a Skyrim modded playthrough. This is Skyrim mod's Hello, big stranger. difference. Hello, stranger. Cause trouble and you'll wish you never came here. What's going on here? I'm Ornab, captain of the Hartmere Militia and we're here to hunt Orc before they overrun the Isle. If the Jarl sees any here, she'll have my head. Uh, maybe I could hunt down a few Orc for you. It's Orcs, but sure. All right. You bring me their war beads, and I'll see you get paid for each one. Uh, where can I find the Jarl? Very likely doing very little in her hall in Hartmere Town. Ouch. Travel to the northwest of the Isle. You can't miss the place. Uh, I'll be on my way then. Farewell for now. Mind how you go, stranger. I will say there's um, some noticeable background noise for the characters so far. The lip sync. Well, lip sync's not a huge issue, and I think the mod author even says on the mod page that they're aware that it's uh, not entirely working. But it looks like there's a ton of um, locations so far on this aisle, so that's always good. Cinder's Retreat discovered. I feel like I'm gonna be here forever. This is this is cool. I like it so far. Oh, requires a key. Never mind. I don't like it that much. Then I don't like it enough to have the key to go inside. Hello there. Stick to the roads, and you'll be all right, stranger. Oh, Dragon Bridge. Yeah. Okay, so there is a separate Dragon Bridge from Dragon Bridge in Skyrim, I guess. All right. Anyone want to talk? Oh, Bernard, look how fancy you are. Careful, I break easily. Oh, I bet you say that to all the hookers you hire. Oh, I can't even talk to you at this angle. Never mind. Careful, I break easily. I'm not a hooker, don't tell me that. Greetings to you. Uh, greetings, old man. Do you live here on the aisle? What? No, sir. I'm just an explorer like yourself. Have you found anything of value here, like that bow on your back? I've poked around a few places, but then I lost my staff. I'm nothing without my staff. Hmm, yes. No. Where? Uh, if you're willing to pay, I'll return it to you should I find it. Hmm, let me see. I haven't much coin. Spent it all on the boat fare getting here. They charged Maybe you? Maybe this old key would interest you. They didn't charge me at all. Uh, what's the key for? It's for a door, silly. A door to a tomb here on the isle. I'd wager it leads to riches unknown. And they could all be yours if you find my staff. The background noise is a little noticeable. <laughs> Alright, it's a deal. Excellent. I'll be here writing my journal while I wait for your return. Bernard's lost staff. Here's what I wonder, though. Because it's it wasn't just for the guard, it's for people who have different voices, it seems. So, 
Was it just like an issue with compressing the voice files? I'm not sure. Hello there. Good. Need something? Oh no, you're just regular. All right then. Normal NPC voice, which is also fine. That's not a bad thing. All right. Oh, what the hell is this woman doing? <gasps> hey, mad woman. You need a good square meal and a haircut. Uh, all right. What the hell's are you doing? I'm making sure my husband doesn't run away again. Okay. Your husband? That's a rabbit. You mad old bint. I had a little accident with me wabberjack. Can't you see he's hungry? Don't stand there like a lemon and go get me a cabbage before he runs off. <laughs> uh, where can I find him a cabbage around here? Cabbage Patch Hero? Oh, yes. Try Farmer Woolly Cullet's farm to the south. Woolly Hurry up. Cullet? He's going to make a break for it. I can see that look in his eye again. What if I killed your husband? What if I... I'm, and I'm not going to. I'm just saying. I could, in theory, kill your rabbit husband. Oh. <gasps> What if I found a way to return him to his human form? Oh, that would be something. Uh-oh. Bandits? Yep, we got bandits. Yours is mine. What's yours is mine, bandit? Wait, wrong. Oh, wait, nope. Don't shoot me. I'm trying to remember my hockeys. Damn it. Aha! There we go. Uh, oh yeah, no, let's go into the mine now. And I'll... I think I'll do orc culling first. You know, the main objective of the mod is to become... Oh, the lighting in here seems a little off. I don't know if it's just me. I don't know if it's the lighting or maybe the tile set, but there's... I don't know, something seems a little off. Or at least, you know, compared to vanilla Skyrim, it just seems... I don't know. I don't know what it is exactly. I can't quite put my finger on it. I'm not entirely sure, to be completely honest. And there doesn't seem to be anyone in here. Which means I'll just go back outside and I'll just have a lovely old time orc culling. Because apparently this island's racist towards orcs. They're a civilized people. Sometimes. I'm just saying. Like, we don't need to go around culling them. Ugh, the nerve of some people, the nerve of these guards. Who did they think they are? All right, yep, back outside we go. Okay, so we have a shrine. Oh, we have a town over there. Oh, hey, there's the dragon bridge. Okay. We have a standing stone. Do we have an actual standing stone here, or are they just using the... I come for something else as I try to get up this mountain and it's not as easy as I thought it would be. Oh no, it is a standing stone. What's it for? Oh, the warrior. Oh, okay. So it's, uh... <laughs> so it's just one of the regular, um... Standing stones from Skyrim. Oh, you're going down, lady. Wait. Ooh, jump attack. Beautiful. I want to take a look at the map real fast, because it does have a custom map, which I always love. Um, hmm. Okay, so... One thing I sort of notice is... I'm guessing these are the clouds for, uh, for Skyrim. The reason I say that is because that is where uh, Throat of the World would be. That might also not be because of the mod. That might be... Um, because of, like, one of the mods I have for maps. Like, I think I have a Clouds mod on for maps. And I think it uses the same map space as Skyrim does, I would assume. Because I haven't had that issue with Falskar or any other mod I've used that shows world space. Oh, well. It's not a big deal. I just, it's something I noticed, and I thought I'd point it out, because I was like, uh, uh, where are all the guards? There's ha uh, fucking bandits hanging out by the bridge. It's nothing. Oh, it's nothing, you say? Let's turn that nothing into something. Just a scratch, just a scratch you say? Just a paper cut, I presume? This second guy's insane much. 
Alright, one down. There we go. Oh, nice try, buddy. Should probably heal up a little bit. Where do you think you're going, buddy? I'll tell you where. You're going to Oblivion and back. That's right, you goddamn son of a bitch. You terrorized the people of Hartmere Isle. I just got here, goddammit. Alright, so yeah, we got a dragon bridge. Dragon Bridge Crossing, discovered. Yeah, the terrain is not generating, or not rendering properly over there just yet, but also it is Skyrim, so render distance is not always the best thing. Oh, there's the town. I will have to go over there at some point. I should probably actually turn on the quest. Orc Culling. Um, okay, so it doesn't have a... doesn't have a waypoint, so I have to find them on my own. But let's go into town, let's speak to the Jarl, maybe she'll tell me something. Or give me another quest, even. Oh, are those the guards? The guards finally show up? I think that's... Yeah, no, the guards are finally here. They're like, oh, someone uh, did our job for us. Would you look at that? I'm like, yeah, no, you're welcome. Also, I checked the mine, there's no one in there. You're also welcome for that. Okay, so there's a house over there. Uh, we got the town. Got something else right over here to discover. Let's find out what the hell it is. Oh! Oh, I like that! Oh, that's cool. I like that. That looks cool. Oh. Uh-oh. What are you doing so close to town? Oh, I thought that would hit both of you. Oh, you're down. She was a lot easier than I thought. Wink. I'm sorry, that was inappropriate. Then again, it's me. Alright, here's the town. What town is this? Like, I don't know the name of the town just yet. I think there's three different towns or something in the whole aisle? Because it's called Three Kingdoms. Need something? On the mod That's file. That's a fine weapon. Sharp and solid. Thank you. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. I do like that they recorded new lines for the guards, that the guards have custom voices. I think that's... I think that's a, a nice level of detail, personally. Yes? All right, then. Like, there's no need for... Oh. You should visit the Jarl if you're new here. All right, well, thank you. No, 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 but you can get away with using the same guard lines, mostly, so I like that they went, you know, took that extra effort to record their that's lines. That's close enough, stranger. Hello, old woman. Are you the town's healer? I just called you an old woman. Watch your tongue, or I'll torch you where you stand. I'm Etty Pegler. You're Edith Winmare's chief advisor. I'm sorry, just go around assuming people are healers for some reason. Uh, is there any way to make some coin around here? You could try asking the Jarl, or Captain Ornab of the Guard, if you can find him. He's most likely patrolling the other side of the island. No, he's on his way here right now. Uh, are there any other jobs you know of? I have something I'd like done, if you don't mind a spot of danger. Just a spot? I don't mind a spot of danger. What do you need? I have an interest in a very special gem, but I fear it's too dangerous for me to risk collecting. I'd like you to fetch it for me. You can hear that the voice is very slightly distorted. Like, I can I can hear it slightly. Where can I find this gem for you? Head east from the town. There's a barrow over near the fort. I'm sure it's in there, but be very careful as I reckon the place is haunted. All right, of course it is. Wait, no, I want to know where the Jarl is. You back already? Okay, never mind, I can't ask you. Hello, Captain Neville. Hi. I Oh, follow me, Captain, for adventure. All right, then. Need something? Follow me for adventure. It's been a pleasure. Oh. Okay. It's one of those doors. Is it one of those towns? Oh, that's Hetty's house. Betty's house. Oh, You're hi there, already. Heidi. Oh, what yes. is with your face? It's so good to see you again. Okay, so we just have random adventurers ready to follow us. Oh, let's talk to Arnold. Need something? Need something? Okay. Till next time. What do you need, my friend? Okay, so we just have a lot of random adventurers who just want to hang out and adventure, it seems. Until next time. Including the captain of the guard. Or one of the captains of the guard, because I've already met another captain. Um, have you seen the Jarl? Oh! 
if you can hold down more than two bottles of mead at the Dragon Bridge Inn, you're a better man than I. Do you really want to admit that you can't hold two bottles of mead? I like the lighting in here. Oh, uh, hello, Edith. Greetings. Oh, her voice I is- I do not recognize you. What brings you to my hold? Okay, her voice has a little distortion too, but I like, I like the voice. Are you the Jarl of this island? I am Lady Edith Windmare. And yes, I am Hartmere's Jarl. What brings you before me, stranger? Uh, I intend to honor your name and become Thane of Hartmere. That's a lofty ambition for someone who's just walked in unannounced. Well, I'm the Dragonborn. However, I do have a few problems that need special attention. What favors can I do for you, my lady? Let's start with my least difficult problem, shall we? Namely, a bandit clan I want gone. Killing their leader, Mervig, will break their morale, I'm sure. There's an E at the end of morale. Consider it done, I shall return with news of his unfortunate demise. It's quite fortunate for us, indeed. We'll see. Many have tried before and failed. They weren't the Dragonborn. I wish you good luck, stranger. Return to me if you are successful, for there is much for you to do here. Much, you say? Started favors for Lady Edith. All right, all right. I do like the longhouse. It's nice. Okay, so we have a little house over here. Hair, hair, hair. There. Let's go discover it before we uh, head on out. I guess I'll keep Orc Culling equipped. Uh, not equipped, but active, but I'll also turn on favors for Lady Edith because, well... That one's marked, so it's easier for me to find and do. I'll find the orcs eventually. Uh, I might break my legs a little bit. Let's see. Hippity hop on down. Very, very light leg breaking. It's fine. Uh-oh. Oh, bandits! So close to town? Oh! No, get out of here, you! You get out of here! You bandit thug mage. Into the water you go! Good. They drowned instantly. Just how I like my bandits. Soggy. And on that note, let's just, uh, pick you up. And, uh, we're gonna get you real soggy, too. Just, uh, one sec, I'm sorry. I know this probably hurts. You're dead, though, so it's fine. Hut! There we go. So is this the house that I can get if I become Thane? I don't know if it was Thane or Jarl that you could become. I have to check again. Probably should have written down. Probably should keep notes when I um take a look at mods. Her <gasps> the brewery. Now I'm excited. Why are all the guards here? Don't you have work to do? Oh, you're a soldier. Sorry, not a guard. All right. Uh, any work available here? Well, old Molly, she works the tables. And you don't look like waiting material to me. However, bandits have been thieving my mead, and I want it back. You want me to find your lost mead? Yarp, and I'll give you 50 gold <laughs> for every bottle you bring back. Oh, and feel free to kill the bastard bandits that stole it. Yarp. Yarp, all right. I'll do as you ask. I knew you'd help me. Yarp. You can't miss art here, Mead. Yarp. It comes in bright red bottles and smells sweet as nectar. Happy hunting. Yarp, happy hunting. I'll be seeing Heart you me later. Heart me mead recovery. Yarp, yarp. Oh. Hi. If I see a dragon, I'll run and hide. You should too. You damn bitch. You fight that dragon when it comes for you. Uh, so let's just... Oh yeah, that's pretty far away, so let's go to... We're just going to fast travel to Dragon Bridge because it will take a few minutes to walk there. And, you know what? Let's save some time. This is probably going to be a uh, a two-week mod if I had to guess. I don't think I'll be able to finish all this in one day. I don't think so, no. Wait, so... Okay, so... Oh, Dragon Bridge, it... Okay, there's just a little lake in between. All right. I see a castle over... Not a castle, but like a fort. Or a tower. Okay. Also, I could be wrong. I guess there's only one city, one kingdom. Even though... I could have sworn the mod was... 
labeled as Three Kingdoms or something like that as the mod file. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure it was. I also wasn't sure how long this mod was, but, um, like, size-wise, this looks... This looks good. Oh, God, that bear just broke his head. He's like, I'm getting out of here. I don't even know where the guy is anymore. I'm blind. Nope, not blind. Okay, I was wondering if they're actually gonna come after me. Oh, paralyzed. Paralyzed. It's okay, I took care of it. I feel bad for that bear, I just... I broke his head against the ceiling, uh, the cave ceiling. <laughs> I, I paralyzed them and then just shot him in the head. Oh. Call the Humane Society. Actually, don't, because I might get hauled off to jail. I'm not sure if that's how the Humane Society works, but still. Nice try using a ward to protect yourself. Although it's actually kind of working. Oh, I missed. Damn ward, I hate that. I hate that spell so much. Oh no, that's a dragon. Oh boy. Okay, I wasn't expecting that. I wasn't sure if we had dragons here. Uh, the different bandit names are from OBIS, Organized Bandits in Skyrim, which is another mod. Where the fuck did that dragon go? There he is. That damn bastard. Oh, here he comes! Oh wait, I should probably... equip... Dragon Rend. Which I can't shout yet anyway, so it's fine. It's fine. If you want to land, that'd be great. Be real useful right about now. Okay, good, good, good. Oh, he was landing anyway. Great. Oh well. A little bit of a waste. Wait, it's fine. We'll kill the dragon. We'll kill it. Oh, wait, nope, I got him. Okay, good. You're welcome. Go upsetting Hetty Pegler. She'd sooner burn you than talk to you. Oh no, I already upset her. If you need a new weapon, you should visit Jornox. I do like that they have custom voices. Is this the guy's farm? Tillywim Farm. Was that his name? Okay, I can't use that door. Where's the farmer? I want to talk to him. Can't use that door either. All right. It's one of those. One of those. Can't use- Ah, oh, can't- Come on! Don't put buildings and doors here if I can't use them. That bothers me. It's a fundamental fucking thing for me. Because it's like, oh yeah, no. What's the great thing about Skyrim? If there's a building, you can go inside. Unless the door is like, very clearly barricaded or the house is like, broken or some shit. But no, it's like, god damn it, I- Ugh. And there's no one here. It's, ugh. I like the mod, but that- That's something that- Often bothers me. Also, woolly color. This was Tilly Will. Unless they're the same person, which is also possible. Look at all these cows. I was gonna kill them, but I realized they're probably. You know, they probably belong to Tilly Will, Cully, Wit, whatever his name is, and, um. That might get me a bounty. And I would rather not have to pay off a bounty here in the lovely land of Hartmere Isle. It is pretty, I do like it. Okay, we got bandits, so let's do... Unrelenting Force. Hi there! Force yeah, I got both of them. It's good. Bandit mind broken. Well, your head's broken too, because I just threw you against that boulder. Where's the other one? Are they already dead? Oh, nope, there they are. Wait. You're going down, lady, I'm sorry. It's nothing personal. You attacked first. I mean, I think I technically did. Because I attacked before you had a chance to attack, but still. You were going to attack me, so... It's, it's fair, it's fine. I do like the terrain. The terrain is well done. And that's not always easy to do in a mod. Like, there are a lot of new land mods are, that are literally just... Oh, this is a flat... Area 
and it's like literally just flat, and there's no terrain variety at all. But this, there's like a good amount of variation. There's like, there's rivers, there's streams, there's lakes. You got enough trees, you got the roads. Oh god, I'm dying. Oh fuck, I died! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Also, I don't know why I screamed oh no so many times. I honestly have no fucking clue. Well, let's go back. Time for a redo. And I do like there's also a decent amount of quests as well. From what I've seen so far. It is well done. And this is, um... The mod was updated very recently, too. This is, um... I want to say it was version 1.5? I think? I don't remember... I don't remember the version number. It might have been 1.9. I don't remember. That part's not... The important part. Tilly Wim Cave! Oh, so Tillywim Cave, and that was Tillywim's Tillywim Farm. So Tillywim is the region, then. Okay. Uh, but yeah, there's a decent amount of quests, which is also something you don't find all the time with uh, new land mods, new world spaces. It's just like, alright, yeah, no, here's a blank, barren, flat land with a few enemies. Have at it. And I'm like, what do you mean, have at it? Oh, what the hell is that? I want to go check that out. Maybe I won't get butt blasted by a goddamn dragon this time. One can hope. Alright, band it down. You're an orc, but I don't think you have... You know, don't have any war beads for me. What are the enemies? Oh, it's probably just slaughter fish in there. Okay, so that's a barrow. That barrow looks... Oh, there's the other bandit. You want to come out of the water? You want to come out? You're going to get all wrinkly in there. I know you're Splish Splash taking a bath, but come on. No? All right, fine. No, no, I'll let you, I'll let you stay in here. And do nothing with your life. Then again, you're a bandit, so you weren't doing much anyway. Okay, I can't really get over these rocks. Yeah, no, it's... What the fuck? Oh, it's invisible walls. Look at this. Okay, also, she's hurting me a bit. Oh, you got out of the water. That's great. And, oh, nope, don't go back in the water. Alright, good. Nope, wrong spell. There's a lighthouse over there. We have this barrow over here. Very elaborate design with all the arches. It looks cool. I like it. I could have sworn I saw someone walking around. Oh, more bandits. Okay, yep, more bandits. Wait, I'm trying to just line you guys up. There we go. Damn it, you put a ward up. Don't do that. Ah, oh, god damn it. I can't move because I'm cold. I've been poisoned. Okay, I'm taking some damage right now. I do not like this. This is not good for me. Alright. Holy shit, I'm actually gonna die again. No, 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 no. Everyone get out of here. I'm playing on Adept as usual. Okay. Also, these skeevers, these ghost skeevers are fucking ridiculous. Okay, no, if I just kill her, then I should be fine. Okay, good. Now they're gone, alright. Just the archers left. And we're gonna be good, just watch. We're good, we're good! Oh. <laughs> now we're good. Yeah, no, I didn't want to die again. Kind of, uh... Already died once. Was not a big fan of it. Would rather not die again. 10 out of 10, would not die again. Let's discover this. Sunken Temple discovered. 
I'll come back here because I would imagine there's going to be a quest of some sort for it, but I'm just kind of exploring, just kind of picking up all the locations I can find. I gotta head back that way and get the cabbage again. I can turn that in. Like, hey, here's cabbage for your husband, who's a rabbit. Also, your insane woman. Just saying. Alright. So we got... Lighthouse. Same model as the Solitude Lighthouse. There's a lot of bandits here. Like, the guards are just shit at their Over job, here. aren't they? Just trying to shout. There you go. And they all went tumbling down. Wait. Wait. Alright, down. Ouch. I was getting my shield out. Oh, that missed. Aha! Blocked you. I think he's trying to pull his sword out, and I'm just not letting him. Yep, no, he was trying to pull out that dagger. I did not let him. Hello? Alright, I guess there's someone up here. Oh, God! I don't know why I got scared by that. I saw her skirt and- Oh, what the fuck?! Come on! Bullshit! 